My name is Vladimir Us, and myself I am an artist and curator. I work in Oberlicht Association, which is a young artist association founded some 15 years ago. We were students on Art Academy. And uh, as Oberlicht Association, we are part of the uh, Hubs project, uh, coordinated by CF. First of all, we uh, try to develop our own, our own work in the context of Moldova and of Chisinau. And it's quite specific context. Uh, you cannot just transfer it to any other location. So the methods of work which we um, elaborate and uh, the strategies which we develop for that particular context are not always possible to apply in a different place. But in general, our work is about uh, opening public spaces for citizens, about the inclusion. It's about uh, developing some uh, new institutional frames, democratic frames for uh, citizens to participate in urban planning, in uh, uh, de redesigning cultural policies, in improving education system in Moldova. The notion of commonality is a new notion today in terms of rethinking what means a common space, what means a public space, first of all, and public space we perceive as a part of democratic infrastructure, which is absolutely needed for any society to develop in a democratic way. It's the hardware where people can meet and through which they can pass on some ideas, uh, they can freely communicate, they can um, uh, do things together. Uh, so the access to public space is very important for us. And then through, once we have the public space, once we have unrestricted access or less controlled public space, we can question what happens to the commons in general. Uh, and what, uh, what were the consequences of privatizing the commons during the last 20, almost five years in Moldova. So we need a space to share our uh, understanding and to acquire a, a new understanding for these notions. And the international work helps us a lot in this, in the sense of meeting uh, people dealing with similar issues in other countries, but also witnessing how uh, different contexts uh, affected this question or influenced the people to act in a specific way. If we look on the uh, United States experience, uh, we can uh, see that even public parks are private today and they are used for uh, private parties. And we still don't have this stage in Moldova. But what we see is that what comes to Moldova after 20 years is a similar model like in the United States or in other uh, Western European countries. And in that sense, we can also anticipate certain uh, situations and try to counteract and uh, propose a different vision for uh, urban development, but also for development of other fields. Um, that's why we act internationally. Beside that, as a small association from Moldova, we uh, need the support to carry out our activities as cultural field is totally unsupported in our country uh, and the international networks is what allows us to um, uh, float let's say not to sink uh, because it's not only about uh, financial resources which we can uh, receive through these networks but it's about knowledge it's about people it's about uh, practices which we uh, uh, acquire and it's also about uh, making our issues known somewhere else and uh, making others aware of what happens in uh, Moldova but not only Moldova in Ukraine and other uh, countries former Soviet uh, republics and going back to the question of culture and uh, the role of culture in society it is definitely a common good it is a right, I think, uh, in the sense that the access to culture should be uh, 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 really uh, uh, protected so that as many people as possible have access to culture, have free access to culture. 
and not only commercial culture, but uh, culture which uh, is uh, um, uh, putting forward questions which are out of public discourse. So that is the culture which can change attitudes and the mentality of, pop of the people. And to uh, make that culture accessible, uh, we need policies which, and we need institutions, actually new types of institutions, which would uh, uh, allow um, as many people uh, have access to specific cultural products, which today are produced at a very low rate and by very few associations or uh, collectives, artistic collectives. Mm -hmm.